Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been a year since the original wave of mini fashion brands came out. I've been waiting for this to happen for so many months now. Also, hi, welcome back to Dolls Must. Welcome to day five. Ooh. But guys, today we're going to be opening five of these little mini fashion brands. I didn't even mean to plan that, but that just worked out perfectly. Day five and five balls. Love that. Hold on. <laughs> But anyways, guys, I am so excited to get these opened. For whatever reason, all the ones at Walmart had these, like, paper things on top of them that they were peeled off. So, love that. But anyways, guys, we are going to open up some mini fashion brands today. But let me roll my intro real quickly and we can get started. Are you ready to jingle your bells? Hi. Okay, guys. So as I mentioned earlier, it's been almost a year since my original two mini fashion brand videos came out. I think I was only missing one purse and two extra like little accessories. Where are those purses? I don't know. I kind of lost them. <laughs> I had them on Rainbow High Dolls. And when I moved my dolls into my bedroom, I kind of just lost everything. But as I mentioned, we have five of these to open today. These retail for $9.99 in the United States. But as I mentioned, these are like little fabric bags that you can get. And they're like doll scale. So obviously I love it because I'm a doll horror and i just love little things <laughs> this time around the ball is completely pink instead of it being white and it just looks like a tufted little bag it says mini fashions series two and it says there's all new designs to collect if you're looking for the ball here is its barcode and it says there's a hundred plus real fabric fashion bags and accessories to collect but that's like everything all together i think that's a little more than what it was originally yeah there's a lot more to collect and a lot more to spend so um Love that. But I guess let's open our first mini fashion series two ball. You guys know um, I'm kind of good and bad with these, but we're going to see if I'm any better. No. Okay, these ones are actually tougher. I really hate these kind of balls. I'm going to try it from the bottom. This is such a flop. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what just happened there, but that took way too long to get off. Like you can see it's like really stuck to the like plastic of the ball. Oh, that'll do it. Okay, guys, so we got our first ball finally unwrapped. Oh my God. I don't know what this series has in store. And let's crack it open and see what they have. So I got two little bags this time, but let's look at the checklist first. This time around, it is pink. Okay, so here are the bags this time around. I really want this one. The shoe's kind of iconic. I would love this blue one for Skylar. And these two are actually really cute too. I don't know if I really care for any of these right here. And then there's the rare ones. Those would be really cool to find along with the super rare little watch and the Tiffany necklace and some extra goodies. But yeah, that's actually pretty cute. Um, There's a lot more to collect this time around. Okay, so I don't know what to open first. Oh, let's open this because it feels like it has the plastic in it. Okay, so this is everything that was in the original bag. So we got this little sticker of a luggage. I'm really hoping I didn't get a luggage. We got this really cute little coin purse and it has an actual like keychain on it. And it doesn't open like the ones from the last season. So we got this little boba drink and the beads inside actually like move around, which is really cool. And then there's like this little like bracelet and I wonder if this will fit a doll. So now it's time to see what bag we got. Just hoping it's a good thing. It doesn't feel like it's a luggage. So that's great. <laughs> Oh, this is kind of cute. <laughs> so, oh, I, I like how this feels. Okay, how do I describe this? It's nice. <laughs> Made of like a pink material that I can't pinpoint right now, but it has a mini fashions little branding right there with some a little gold buckle details and it opens. Of course, you can store all the goodies you just got. There's a little piece of tissue in there so it keeps its shape. This is a really nice bag though. I don't know who I'm going to give this to now out of Rainbow High, but um, there's a lot of pink dolls. So someone's going to enjoy this. So let's get it all set up inside. We're going to put her drink in there. A little bangle she probably stole and her little purse oh that's so cute i really love these guys oh my god yeah i'm not mad at the first bag we got let's see what it is on the checklist seems like this is a common one but there's also like scented accessories it seems so like the perfumes and all that stuff so that's kind of cool um i'm not sure if the original did that but anyways guys let's open our second ball so I'm really hoping I get that one bag that I really really want that's pink it looks like it has like a chain so obviously I really really want it We almost did it, okay? I really don't like these kind of balls. I just hate plastic so much. Okay, let's see what we got in ball number two. So we're gonna open, obviously, the accessories first. It'll get off me. So if you guys watched the original video I did of these, you guys know I got like the ultra rare like Tiffany ring in like my, I think, first or second try, which was really cool. So um, I'm hoping I could do that again with my first video. So, um, oh wait, I see. <laughs> what i'm talking about oh my god is this the rare thing oh my god the tiffany box obviously um let me open everything else before i go into like crazy depth <laughs> okay so this is everything we got in the first ball minus this piece of paper so that's the bag i really really want to get as a sticker we have this cute little gold hairbrush this makeup i'm assuming it's mascara yep and then we got this tiffany box so um it opens like the other it has an actual ribbon on it this time and i'm not sure if this is a real doll necklace oh my god i think it is oh <gasps> 
Whoa, that's actually really, really cool. I wonder how this would fit over a doll's neck. It actually could go on it, which is really cool. So it's like this like silver little mini fashions like bag pendant. And oh my God, this is so cool. I can't wait to try this on a doll. Oh my God. Yeah, that was really cool. And I was just speaking of it. Yeah, so it just seems like it's a rare. Okay guys, now we gotta see what bag we got to match that, that Tiffany necklace. Honestly, not mad at it. It's a neutral bag, so that's really good. Um, any character could really wear this. I can actually see Harper wearing this because it kind of goes with that tan kind of color scheme, but that's the only doll I could really think of at the moment, but this is really cute. It's a fake leather bag, kind of like a sand color bag with some black details as well, and it just opens and you can put all your things inside. So let's put in our little Tiffany, our hairbrush, and our mascara. And like that, we have opened ball number two. This was a really exciting ball, oh my God. <laughs> Okay, so ball number three, I'm really hoping to get my pink little bag. Um, I think it's like machine, like inspired or something. Yeah, they really need to fix the plastic wrapping on these balls. Okay, so for ball number three, I, like I said, I really wanna get this bag right here. We have three more chances. This bag seems a little harder and there's something big in it. So I'm gonna see what this could possibly be. I'm not sure if the luggage like is its own bag or if it's like one of the extra accessories. So I'm um, very curious about that. So we got a duplicate sticker. Oh, that's kind of cool. We got some like headphones and they're like brown. Oh, that's actually really cool. I'm gonna see if this would like fit on like pop. Oh my God, these move. Ah! Okay, I'm gonna try to see if these fit on Poppy because I would totally recolor these orange just for her. Oh my, <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Okay, so this is like really cool. It's the same thing as the Tiffany box, but this time it's orange and black. It's very Halloween-y. I think there's three options for this. So I'm not sure if this is gonna be a necklace or anything else, but we got to open it and see. Oh, it's another necklace. So it's pretty much the same thing I just got with the blue box, but um, gold this time. Oh, that's actually pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. It's right there on the back. So I'm not sure if that means it's rarer or not. So far, I'm really liking everything that came in this bag. And last but not least is a little gold lipstick bullet and it has a peachy shade inside of it. But now guys, it's time to see what bag we got. Oh, that's actually kind of cool. It's like a white, like fake leather bag. Very much reminding me of like Ed Hardy. If you guys remember Ed Hardy, let me know. I, I'm, I'm old, I know, but like, <laughs> it's actually really cool. Um, This would look really good with Maria Garcia. You know, they gave her roses instead of marigolds. But yeah, um, I think it looked really cool with her. I'm definitely not going to be able to fit that ring inside of here or the headphones. So um, only the lipstick is going to go inside. And there's like a little magnet so it keeps itself closed. Now let's open our next ball. I still haven't gotten any duplicates and I know the minute I mentioned it, I'm gonna get a duplicate that happened last time. I've kind of come to the conclusion that I'm not gonna get a perfect peel on this video at all. I don't know why the mini brand gods are against me today, but like once you get them off, it's like so much easier. Ball number four. So this feels like our plastic bag, well, plastic accessory bag. So um, let's see what's inside it. So first we have our sticker. Next we got this like kind of cool hat. It's like a tan color and it has the MF for mini fashions on it. It's completely made of plastic. This definitely would probably fit a Barbie doll. But this time around we got some sunglasses and they are in a different shape than last time. They still open, which is really cool. Oh my God. <laughs> and at least we got our first like little keychain, which I believe these actually could go on bags. And it feels like it's metal because it's super heavy. It's a little teddy bear that's red and it's supposed to look like a Supreme like chain, obviously. So Ruby would love this. It's like really heavy though. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna try to now like hang this on something from one of these bags. So uh, yeah, that's actually really cool. Okay, let's see what bag we got because maybe it'll match that bag and we can just put it on there. Okay, um, this would be a good bag for maybe Harley. I don't know. Fake leather bag again. It has like this really cool print on it and the handle almost looks like it's been tied. And to open this bag, there's an actual like zipper. But yeah, I'm gonna put the sunglasses in there. Now, if I am correct, um, the first wave of these did not have zippers. They were mostly like magnetized kind of bag. I could be wrong because I kind of remember these zippers. I am like struggling with this bag. But yeah, um, there's nothing really I could like attach this to. I feel like it would be like a good contrast too if I put it on this bag. Okay, guys, so we're on our final ball. I am gonna hope and pray it is the one I really, really want. And I would love to get a perfect peel. So mini brand gods, let me have this one, please. <laughs> You know what? I'm not even doing it on camera. This is the final ball for this video. I'm very sad because I really love these little guys and I'm just hoping I get the one I really, really want. Now, I'm not sure if I'm gonna do more of these. We shall see. I might just do another round if this video does well enough. Until now, we will do five of these and see how it goes. So definitely share this video with your friends if they like mini stuff like I do and all that jazz. So we can do more openings together. <laughs> Let's see what's in this one. I hear like a chain in here. So I'm thinking we got another keychain. So first things first, we have a sticker of that shoe bag, which is so cool. Next, we got this like magazine that says so hot, so mini. And, and then on this side, they're like doing it like as earrings. And it's just like an actual like little magazine. <laughs> That's kind of cute. 
some baggies I already got in this a little magazine. Next, we got our second mascara, but this is a different variation of it. So we got the second bear um, little keychain. Again, it's just like the original one that I got earlier, but this time it's black and it has different logos on it. This one I can see being more like Louis Vuitton. And now it's time to see if we got a duplicate or if we got the bag I really, really want. Um, I'm just hoping it is like the bag I wanted. Nope, it's a duplicate. <laughs> um, I'm not mad though. It's funny though, because I was just saying that this would look really good on this bag. So it's, it's a sign. Okay guys, I'm gonna go find that little lipstick that went flying and I'm gonna show you all of the little items all lined up next to each other with maybe a dollar or two holding some of the accessories and all that. So um, yeah, BRB. Okay guys, so here's just a quick overview of everything that I got inside of my five balls. I'm not showing the stickers obviously because they're not that important to me. It's mainly the stuff inside that counts. <laughs> but now I'm gonna get like a doll and just basically see how everything's gonna look in their hands. Okay, so here's Maria Garcia from Rainbow High. As I mentioned earlier, I thought this bag would match her because she has a lot of roses on her and I think it looks pretty good. It's actually a really good scale as well. As I mentioned earlier, these fit pretty well for Barbies and Rainbow High style dolls. I actually do really wanna try a G3 Monster High doll because they are a little thicker and slightly taller some of them like Frankie. <laughs> Here is that tan bag on Frankie from Monster High G3. It actually looks pretty good on them as well. Um, it's a little big but some bags are pretty big in general but yeah let's see what else looks good on them. So for the hat yeah it's definitely not gonna fit any of these big head dolls. It's definitely for a Barbie doll kind of style doll. The same goes for the headphones. These would be great though around a doll's neck or just holding them. Obviously the brush is perfect for scale along with most of the makeup products as well. Personally, the drink looks the best for scale. And here's Frankie next to the box with the necklace in it. It definitely is going to go around their neck and be pretty long, actually. Okay, guys, so this is everything that we got. I'm going to let Frankie sit here and model it because Maria can't really sit in her dress. But honestly, I'm not mad with everything I got. I'm pretty happy with all these bags. I definitely think they have taken the bag up a notch compared to the original series of this wave. And I think a lot of the accessories are really cool now. I didn't really like a lot of the plastic ones from the original wave because a lot of them were just repeat but there's a lot of new ones with these new bags so I'm very excited about that. I really like how some of them have keychains. There's some scented ones. I didn't get any of those of course but they're out there so I guess smell your mini brands. <laughs> But I honestly think that these are going to be great for any kind of doll you have um, that's in a kind of like this kind of scale. I don't remember what it's called, but you know, you get it. <laughs> but honestly, guys, I definitely would like to do more of these. I need to know you guys are enjoying these kind of videos. You guys seem to really like the first two videos I did of these. So let's see if you guys like it a year later. <laughs> but anyways, guys, if this is your first time watching my channel, hi, my name is Jay and I do doll stuff. Duh. And I would love you guys to join the channel. And if you aren't following me on Instagram or on TikTok, it's at Zombie Court as well. I'll see you in tomorrow's video, which is another miniature thing. Yeah. Uh, you're, you'll, you'll probably like it. It's actually really cool. But until then, bye guys. <laughs>